as one of three teams during Euro Festival, you are flying on F-16. Do you have a feeling that for the spectators, there will be a sort of challenge of which show will be more impressive? Yeah, in the point of spectators, it would be good to watch here three different teams. But uh, I know that they are looking for exciting maneuvers and lots of sound. But the uh, flight safety comes first for us. Yeah, we are eager to show the best maneuvers that we can do. Uh, but uh, as I said, flight safety comes first. So we will uh, do the maneuvers in our limitations and we will let the spectators choose which is yeah, the best. Yeah, okay, okay. okay, fair enough. Yeah. What evolutions and special effects you've prepared for Polish spectators? Uh, for Polish spectators, we get uh, some really good maneuvers that we trained in the previous years. We have a solid roll, and I don't know if uh, the Polish spectators heard about it, but the it's only be done by the solo trip team, and I think they will enjoy it when they will see. Okay, okay. And finally, how does it feel to fly on F-16? Uh, I think I cannot see it in words. Okay. It's, okay. it's really, really enjoyable. Also, uh, flying in the low altitude uh, makes it much more enjoyable than the other flights. It's so powerful aircraft, so fast aircraft, and uh, it's a hard aircraft. It uh, really makes you get tired physically and mentally, but the, the enjoyment that you get at the, la at the uh, end of the flight is, yeah. I think, you cannot compare it uh, okay. anything. Okay, okay, great. How much time it takes to prepare for the show, for the show like this? Yeah, I see. Uh, for the show like this, uh, indeed, we train a whole the year. Uh, not especially for the air shows, but we prepare for the uh, demonstrations in our country also. But for this show, yes, we had some uh, practices and it takes for uh, a month nearly. Uh, we, pra we practiced new maneuvers, but uh, the whole year we keep on practicing all the maneuvers that we have.